Hey guys, how are you all? Another beer video. This time I have a brew from Wild Vine Brewing uh, Nut Crusher, a peanut butter porter at 6% ABV. Uh, it's been a minute since I've done a porter. I think one of my first YouTube videos ever was a porter. It was like a maple porter by Coalition, I think, or Combination, I forget. But I think that was one of the very few, if not the only porter video uh, I've done since I've started doing YouTube. And this bottle's already open, as you can tell, right there. Um, because there's a buddy of mine's here and we're drinking a ton of beers and I'm like, dude, why don't we just start doing reviews of all the beers we're drinking because we're gonna be drinking a ton of beers. So this may be one of a few that I'm gonna be doing tonight or it'll just be the one and we'll just like totally get trashed and I totally forget about doing it. But let's get this into a glass, see what it looks like, smells like, and tastes like. And I have not had this before. Um, I haven't had a porter in a long time actually. So uh, this, will be, this will be a good change of pace because I've just been drinking a lot of hazy IPAs of course um, and a few stouts here and there. But uh, pour with about, let's say, half a finger of just, you know, khaki, light mocha head, I suppose. Putting it to the light, it's actually fairly dark. Um, it's not quite black, I would say. It's a very, 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 very dark, dark, dark mahogany <coughs> color. But, uh, I mean, for, you know, purpose of just not having a light all the time, I suppose. Let's just call it black. Um, if, you're, if you're not putting it to the light, like a really bright light. It's it's basically just black. Uh, let's get into the aroma. All right, so first off, tons of peanut butter. Kind of vaguely smells like a Reese's peanut butter cup. And then you get this, um, I don't know, it smells thin to me. I'm not sure how you can smell uh, thinness, but it definitely smells thin to me. It's weird, I, I, I don't know. But definitely you get the uh, peanut butter and like this very sweet vanilla maple -y. maybe not maple, but like vanilla sweetness that comes through. It's actually really nice. Maybe slight like malty coffee too. But primarily you just get vanilla and peanut butter, which sounds freaking amazing, man. Let's get into it. Cheers. It is definitely very thin, very thin. And that's what I expected going into this because it's a porter. Um, I'm, I don't think I've ever had a porter that's like thick or heavy on mouthfeel. But this actually isn't bad. It pretty much is kind of like, I would say a peanut butter sandwich. Not peanut butter jelly, just peanut butter sandwich in a glass. Uh, maybe peanut butter and Nutella sandwich. Um, that's with kind of lighter, so you would put thick or heavy uh, peanut butter on one slice and then just very a very thin film of Nutella on the other slice. Um, that's exactly what this tastes like. It's actually pretty good. Uh, the vanilla comes through right after the uh, peanut butter, as soon as it hits your tongue. It's very, 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 very low bitterness because it's a porter. Um, I don't think I ever had a porter that was like super bitter at all. Maybe like a coffee porter. Uh, that has uh, that coffee bitterness, but this is very, very low in bitterness. And you get that nice vanilla finish too. That comes through right after the, excuse me, that comes through right after the peanut butter. This is decent beer, Ben, for uh, not having anything from this brewery before, uh, not having a porter in a long time. This, this is pretty good. Um, it's kind of like a watered down Reese's peanut butter cup in a glass uh, or that Nutella sandwich I was talking about. Um, but yeah, this is uh, Wild, Wild Ride Brewing, a nut crusher, a peanut butter porter at 6% ABV. If you guys like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more videos, comments, leave them below. And as always, your big dreams and believe all things possible. Thank you for watching. Cheers.